Australia has the highest rate of mammal extinctions and one of the highest overall extinction rates in the world, with 448 animals currently threatened with extinction. Think about that—448 animals, precious and amazing native animals threatened with extinction. Why do we have such a staggering rate of species lost? It's because of neglect by government after government, Labor and Liberal alike. It's because this government, the Abbott, Turnbull, Morrison, whatever it's going to be next week government, is wholeheartedly supporting the logging of our native forests. It's allowing broad-scale clearing for agriculture and property developers. It's slashing jobs and funding in the Environment Department. It's doing sod all against, about climate change, except changing leaders, and is not doing enough to eradicate pest animals like foxes and cats. Yet this government then turns around and has the audacity to host a threatened species event at Parliament, showcasing rare and endangered threatened species like the Tasmanian devil, the olive python and the even rarer and more endangered female Liberal minister. This event in Parliament was an opportunity for coalition MPs to get a cute feel-good pick with a fluffy koala for social media. Meanwhile, they stand by and allow their habitat to be destroyed. Did you know that koalas are set to be extinct in New South Wales by 2050 because of logging and land clearing? It's astounding and appalling that a country as rich, as developed, as, as wealthy as ours is robbing future generations of their chance to know and to love our precious wildlife. That's why the Greens set up the much-needed Senate inquiry into the extinction crisis to shine a light on what is killing our wonderful animals and what needs to happen to protect them. And over 12,000 Australians have already let this inquiry know of their concern about our threatened wildlife. This is a massive show of public support for urgent, strong action to end the extinction crisis. There are 448 Australian animals that are either critically endangered, endangered or vulnerable. And in the seven minutes that I've got left, I'm going to see if I can name them all to give you a feel for what's at stake, the extent of the extinction crisis that we face. I'm going to start with the mammals that are critically endangered. The Christmas Island shrew, Leadbeater's possum, Northern hairy nosed wombat, southern bent wing bat, Christmas Island pipistrelle, Gilbert's potteroo, western ringtail possum, Christmas Island flying fox, central rock rat. And then there are the birds that are critically endangered the King Island scrub tit, the grey range thick billed grass wren, Regent honey eater, curlew sandpiper, great knot, Mount Lofty Ranges spotted quail thrush, Capricorn yellow chat. Swift parrot, helmeted honey eater, northern Siberian bar tailed godwit, Tiwi Islands hooded robin, orange bellied parrot, eastern curlew, plains wanderer, western ground parrot, round island petrel, herald petrel. The frogs that are critically endangered armoured mist frog, mountain mist frog, southern corroboree frog, northern corroboree frog. Croombit tinker frog. And then there are the reptiles that are critically endangered. The short nosed sea snake, the leaf scaled sea snake, Christmas Island blue tailed skink, southern snapping turtle, Christmas Island forest skink, Christmas Island gecko, Nangua spiny skink, Gulbaru gecko, western swamp tortoise, George's snapping turtle. And the fishes that are critically endangered, silver perch. Spotted handfish, grey nurse shark, the east coast population, flathead galaxias, western trout minnow, spear tooth shark, opal cling goby, red handfish. Then there are the other animals that are critically endangered the bogo moss snail, Campbell's helicarionid land snail, the Australian fritillary, the hairy marin the Ammonite snail, the Lord Howe Island phasmid, Margaret River burrowing crayfish, the Dunsborough burrowing crayfish, 
freshwater crayfish, Fitzroy Falls spiny crayfish, magnificent helicarionid land snail, Bornemitz's stag beetle, Glenelg freshwater mussel, Derwent River sea star, Gray's helicarionid land snail, Phillip Island helicarionid land snail, Francistown cave cricket, Masters carapid land snail, Arid bronze azure, which I think may be a, a butterfly, I'm not sure. Rosewood keeled snail, Mount Lidgebird carapid land snail, White legs land snail, Banksia montana mealybug, Stoddart's helicarionid land snail, Golden sun moth, Mitchell's rainforest snail. Then moving on to the mammals that are endangered. Silver headed antichinus, black tailed antichinus, Subantarctic fur seal, blue whale, woylie, northern, northern betong, mountain pygmy possum, northern quoll, spotted tail quoll, North <coughs> Queensland, spot tailed quoll, eastern quoll, southern right whale, Arnhem leaf nosed bat, southern brown bandicoot, eastern, marla, bramble cay melamis, the black footed tree rat, Kimberley in the mainland Northern Territory. Numbat, bridled nail tail wallaby, Dibbler, Western Barred Bandicoot, Shark Bay, Eastern Barred Bandicoot, the mainland version, Mahogany Glider, Cape Rock Rock Wallaby, Cape York Rock Wallaby, Narbalek from the top end, and that was number 100 of these species, Narbalek from the Kimberley, the black flanked Rock Wallaby, the Proserpine Rock Wallaby, Long Footed Potteroo, Smoky Mouse, Hastings River Mouse, Heath Mouse, Tasmanian Devil, Kangaroo Island Dunnart, Sandhill Dunnart, Kangaroo Island Echidna, Carpentarian Rock Rat. The birds that are endangered. King Island Brown Thornbill, the Christmas Island Goshawk, the Bulu Grey Grass Wren, the Carpentarian Grass Wren, the Gawler Ranger's Short-tailed Grass Wren, the Tasmanian Wedge-tailed Eagle, Noisy Scrub Bird, Rufus Scrub Bird, Australasian Bittern, Red Knot, the Red-tailed Black Cockatoo, Southeastern, Borden's Cockatoo, the Glocky, Glossy back, Black Cockatoo from Kangaroo Island, Carnaby's Cockatoo, Southern Cassowary, the Tasmanian Azure Kingfisher, Christmas Island Emerald Dove. Lesser Sand Plover, the Northern Island, Norfolk Island Green Parrot, Coxon's Fig Parrot, Eastern Bristlebird, Western Bristlebird, Amsterdam Albatross, Tristan Albatross, Northern Royal Albatross, Alligator's River, Alligator River's Yellow Chat, Gordian Finch, Christmas Island Frigate Bird, Chestnut Rumped Heath Wren from the Mount Lofty Ranges, the Buff Banded Rail from the Cocos Keeling Islands, Lord Howe Woodhen, Southern Giant Petrel, Purple Crowned Fairy Wren, Western, Black Eared Miner, Crimson Finch, White Bellied, Starfinch, Eastern, Norfolk Island Boobook, Abbott's Booby, the Forty Spotted Pardalote, the Night Parrot, Christmas Island White Tailed Tropic Bird, the Southern Black Throated Finch, the Golden Shouldered Parrot, Western Heath, Western Whipbird, Gould's Petrel, Australian Painted Snipe, New Zealand Antarctic Tern, Fluru Peninsula Southern Emu Wren, the Mallee Emu Wren, Grey Headed Albatross, Chatham Albatross, Christmas Island Thrush, the Buff Breasted Button Quail, Tiwi Masked Owl. Moving on to the frogs that are endangered, the white-bellied frog, the burralong frog, the yellow-spotted tree frog, Australian lace-lid, lace curanda tree frog, waterfall frog, common mist frog, spotted tree frog, flays frog. I'm only up to one, number 165 and I've only got half a minute to go, so I'm not going to get to the end of, of those 448 threatened and endangered Australian animals. I apologise to those that left out. They are just as significant, just as threatened and, and just as important as the others. So take them as read and please, all Australians, I call on you to take action to end this extinction crisis. And a great way to start 
is to vote Greens and vote out this mob at the next Order. election. Senator as Rice, as soon as time possible. for the contribution has expired.